everybody. This is Tony, and we're here at Hot Cakes and Hot Rods, and I'm with my friend Rudy. How you doing, Tony? Good, Rudy. How are you? Excellent. Beautiful day. Um, oh. Great day to be out and having coffee and uh, running with the guys. Yeah, it is a great morning, and you know, it's nice to have these weekly uh, adventures out here, and you know, you get a chance to catch up and everything. Tell you what, you've got a really nice 36 uh, Plymouth here. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah, you know, I, I don't think I would have been able to purchase it if the guy knew what I was going to do to it. But uh, anyway, one of those things. He was one of those guys that uh, wanted to keep it stock kind of thing? Yeah, actually, it was very, uh, very stock, very original. Uh, it still had the Flathead 6 in it with a speed, uh, three-speed tranny. And uh, yeah, I, I, I put a little bit bigger engine in there um, because I wanted to put air conditioning in the vehicle and, um, you know, have a little more horsepower. So I put a, a 318 along with a, a five-speed tranny, so I'm, I'm pretty comfortable with it. Now, how long have you had this car? Um, I believe I've had it four years. Yeah? Yeah, and um, I've, I've had uh, the suspension done, uh, redone. Uh, one of the reasons was I was driving down the freeway when it was still with a flathead, and that thing could actually move out pretty good, but uh, I changed lanes, and I'd never even moved my hands on the steering wheel, so uh, oh, wow. it was a... Um, solid uh, solid suspension but uh, you know you change lanes whether you wanted to or not oh wow so you have to really be careful yeah <laughs> you know you hit a rut and you're over in the next lane ouch, ouch. <laughs> I mean, we're here celebrating the merciful's 50th and yes. uh, we were established in 1968 and how long have you been a member i think i've been a member five years uh plus or minus but yeah uh, my brother was actually the one that uh, introduced me to the club Right. Prior to that, um, I had a 41 Chevy uh, for a couple years, and then uh, before that, uh, throughout my life, I pretty much rode bikes and, uh, you know, just decided to change. I'm getting a little bit older. My reaction time is not as good, and uh, actually it's almost zero, so, you know, it's better to have something wrapped around you as opposed to, you know, skidding down the road. It's, it's good to know your limits. Yeah, you know, that's for sure. Your brother has that 58 Fairlane. That's a nice car. Yeah, that's kind of embarrassing to say, so I won't even expound on that. Okay, we'll cut that part out. Oh, no, <laughs> leave it in. <laughs> so, and you're the treasurer of the club. Yes, that's correct. Right on. So, uh, five years in and you're in charge of all the dough. Yeah, and actually <laughs> our treasury is, uh, has grown. Um, we, we have enough to uh, pull off the uh, Christmas show. Yeah. And uh, we're so grateful for that. As a, as a merciful, yeah, you know, that's one of the highlights of the year for me. Oh, yeah. I think for all of us, uh, our annual toy drive, Spark the Love Toy Drive and Car Show, which we usually have here, but this year we're looking at a different venue because it's just grown so oh, it, large. It's huge. Yeah, yeah. it yeah. is. It is. Well, I uh, want to say thank you for sharing your car, and uh, it looks so sweet. And also, I hope it takes good care of you. Well, uh, so far it has, and you know what, I'm, I'm really grateful because uh, I first saw uh, a 36 Plymouth at one of the swap meets, uh, and probably took me two years to find one that was, uh, you know, rebuildable, and uh, this one was, as I said, it was pretty much stock, and there's some r rust issues, but nothing that I would consider major, Right. and, um, you know, I did want to change the suspension and put you know, uh, uh, airbags in and, you know, give me the uh, the possibilities to, to make it look the way it looks now. So, well, it looks great. Uh, thank you. Yeah. I appreciate that. All right. Well, uh, thanks again for bringing it out, and I really dig it. So if you want to see more of the car, take a look at mercifuls.com. All right. Thanks, Rudy. Thank you, Tony. All right. Take care.